Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Sigval here, welcome back to my videos. So, um, here we're gonna go ahead and uh, kill my boy Constantine, but first we gotta get to him. We have a flash to the left, we're gonna use um, Puppet Lord Choker over here, with level 9 puppets, so let's get this going. Should be fired. Might have a bit of trouble at the start getting infinite power to start, because we don't have the special disabled effects. Oh, also, this man hits hard. Oh, chill, bro. Chill. How did you get priority in that exchange of hits there, man? Okay, we at least got his attack reduced at this point. By the way, that Grod is not built. Like, he's not dealing that much damage through all the attack reduction. Okay, we got the infinite power going, and we got blind, so we should be fine. Just need to not tank the super move. Uh, tag this man in. He's gonna die, that's fine. Let me also do this for one additional negative effect for a bit to make sure I don't lose infinite parts. Super move, and now we can start pushing him to the corner. Like, as far as losing infinite part, that's not a concern because we, we got the two negative effects from just hitting him. That's not gonna happen. Boy, my man Joker dealing some very serious amounts of damage here. This should be over in like, my guess is 30 seconds. By one minute left, he's gonna be le he's gonna be dead. Now that we get him into the optimal position, come on, almost there. There we go. Let's move on to killing Constantine, actually. Okay, so here we have Batman the Drowned with God Killer at level 9. We got Robin King with uh, Puppet, and we got uh, this man with Twin Blades, hopefully. Okay, let's open with this man, because th there might be some random stuff happening at the start, but once we get things going, it's not gonna matter that I have basically no HP. Excuse me. Oh boy. Hmm. He had to lock the cat in the kitchen because he, he he was acting up. He was just non-stop screaming and running around the house because he wants me to play with him. And I actually played with him for half an hour in between videos because I usually record both of my videos for the day one after the other. And I took a break. I played with him for half an hour, and he would still uh, he was still not taking chill for an answer, and uh, he was messing with the, the computer wires. Bro, the cats are smart, but in a very bad way for you to an extent. Because, like, he's, he's gonna mess with the computer wires. If I didn't pay him no mind when he did that the first time, he probably would have done it a few times. But I told him to stop, and by that I signaled to him that I care about him doing that. So now every single time that I, I, I want... He wants to attract my attention, he's gonna go straight to the goddamn computer wires. Yeah, like he's got some pulling force too. Uh, he's not chewing on them, thankfully. But I've had so far like four or five times when I was like, why is my PC not turning on? And then I look at the power cord and it was literally plugged out of the PC. I mean, this is also not that bad. I've heard of cats that, from from friends, it's got a cat that uh, was literally able to unplug the TV while he was playing on PlayStation, and the cat was actually making the logical connection in its head that if I what happened there, I don't know. I, I stopped being able to do that combo, but whatever. But yeah, the cat made the logical conclusion. I can just. I can just plug this man's TV out, so he's gotta stop playing on PlayStation. Uh, but yeah. 
let's take a look at the rewards we got for this one bro this man is easy if you have batman this man is easy with a lot of things like i i I don't know what I did in that fight, I just went full autopilot mode for the most part. Let's take a look at the rewards we got for this one. Virtues, first of all, I just want to point out that this is Heroic 7 that I just cleared. And I have dropped zero Constantine shards so far. And we got... Oh, Nightmare Bad, man! That's what I was hoping for. For sure not Constantine shards. So, there's a... I, it's it... Wait, 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 wait. How much is the chance? Because I'm actually mad about this. So, okay, we click this, and where's the 15%? So, I'm not even going to count the 3% on normal mode, I don't care about that. But I have, it, this is the equivalent of opening 7 chests where you have 15% to get something, and not getting that something. Uh, I hate so much the the the. I I mean I don't hate the fact that we we get legendaries drop from soul rays. I think that's great, but the way they do it specifically, I hate it so much. All right, so here you have Raven with Dark Metal cards. We got Raiden with Twin Blade over here, and we got Plastic Wonderman with Twin Blade at level one. Let's kill Batman. This man is immune to dot damage, so it was probably gonna be this team killing him. If anything was gonna one shot him, I mean Batman the John too, but that's already been used. Okay, just keep comboing, chopping him. This this fight should be easy. I was just kind of. Uh, yeah, the mistake was finishing it in a swipe. If I don't finish attacks in a swipe, I'm, I've got them pretty comfortable at combo and dropping with Raven. And that's quite something considering how awful her combos seem to me at, at the, when she got released. And don't get me wrong, they are still awful. Whoever designed this and thought to himself, I, I did such a great job. No, you, you did a garbage job. It's just a character that's strong and good and people are gonna learn how to play it no matter how shitty it is designed from a gameplay perspective but those are not basics that feel human they they, they, they don't feel okay people just gotten used to them and now they feel like eh it's fine but trust me whenever i got my hands on first raven i was like oh what what is this diarrhea level of basics Because you have a character that was released close by to characters that some of them were good, some of them were not, but they, they all had very, very good and on point design, man. Like Manta. Manta's basics are smooth. Enchantress, it feels amazing to play against her, not to play against her, but that's a whole other story. And then you have Raven. Who... And she's literally wobbling her hands. It's like they're made out of plastic. It's just, it's literally, if I, if they made Plastic Man, if they put Plastic Man into this game and they gave him the Raven moveset, that would fit perfectly. I wouldn't even be mad about that one. Those more wobbly and more gooey than Martian Manhunter. That man is changing shapes while he's fighting. Uh, yeah, let's move on to the next fight to R Raven Rant aside. I mean, I love her. She's great, but man, they did her dirty. All right, so here I got Hawkman. He's annoying. I'm just gonna use Beast Boy. Here we're gonna use Manta. And here we're gonna use Flash with Twin Blade. Flash is there because he gives me a bit of crit damage. Yeah, this man is, as I, as I previously said... I mean, I keep repeating myself about certain things, but the sorry keeps repeating itself, itself. But yeah, this man is annoying to fight. Generally speaking, one of the characters that where, where, where they really stop caring how it feels to fight them. I mean, if you're good at combo interruption, you're probably gonna still be fine. I just don't want to bother with this man. Okay, let's try to keep infinite power going. We're probably gonna be able to 
survive the super move, so I'm gonna wait for my own super move until after his. So we get a bit of negative effects going. Okay, super move. He's gonna super move me. That's fine. Probably should have left him super move me if we, we if we want to minimax this. Because if he super moved me, then I would have had like one additional second of kept combo at the end of it. But it doesn't matter. And yeah, I was I was talking about the the, the goddamn I, I don't even know if in this video or the, the previous video, but yeah, I was I was talking about being too damn hot outside is like 40, 40 degrees Celsius Celsius. They literally can't go outside the house to to be active, go places, do things, touch grass. I remember we went to do a little bit of drinking at a friend's house, and then uh, we decided to walk. I I do like walking, especially if I'm not walking alone and I got one of my homies with me, and. Uh, I mean, for 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 those pe for the people in America, uh, you you might be like, oh, just one and a half hours of walking. You might you might have been. Yeah, you are real close. No, man. In Europe, if you're walking one hour and a half, it's like more or less equivalent of going from city to city to that extent. But yeah, it was a one and a half hour walk because he was on the very very outskirts of the city, and like, bro. We we were we were getting sweaty at 2 a.m. in the morning because it was so hot outside. Like this is sun Christian, and I've been trying to to like exercise a bit at home. I get I get a VR, playing playing my Beat Saber on the VR, and uh, get a rowing machine. But man, dude, I I definitely miss going outside. They never thought to go outside more during the winter than the summer. But yeah, looks like we're gonna kill this. Easily enough. With a lot of time left. Yeah, let's move on to the last fight. Hey, right, let's go here with Satana with Puppet equipped. Joker with Dark Metal cards equipped. And DPI with uh, uh, Twin Blade equipped. Yeah, Joker being full, I, I don't know at this point, like, the, the lethal damage passive seems a bit better, so I don't know if level 4 class ascension EPI is better, than, is better than Joker or the other way around, but I have him at max class ascension, max class passive anyway, so why not, why not do that? First up, we need to power turn it a lot, because we want to activate the puppet from Zatanna, obviously. Okay, we get free special one. Not the best thing, not the worst thing. Okay, and our free special two. That's actually the absolute best outcome because it puts you to maybe get another free special, which we didn't get, but it's fine. Okay, no free special here, and we're we're I think literally one special away from triggering infinite power. Damn it, Zatanna. What have you done? Oh, can we disable his specials? We might not be able to disable his specials. Okay, come on, please. Oh, we, we can, we can, we, we can get all the negative effects on him. Why am I not triggering infinite power? What's going on? I, there's no way I'm this unlucky. Okay, there it is. I mean, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it, but now but I know for a fact he can actually... And I lost it! For what? Okay, get your ass back in there. Activate and now I activated it with one special after not doing specials for and lost. This is awful. What's going on here? What's messing this up so badly? I and he blocked this one. Well, he's got blind for now. I'm at the point where I'm probably just gonna tag the ten in until I get a blind on him and then tag Joker back in. Oh boy. Ah, oh, this is awful. So many free second specials too. 
what's going on i've done like seven specials with zatanna and infinite or just fails to get them activates there's gotta be something about this guy there's gotta be some negative effect that he's immune to for some reason that's messing this up because there's no way a level nine puppet would, would, would fail me this hard No, not like this, not like this. I managed the combo interruption out of anger all the way until that point. There you go. Get out of here. I don't care if Palpa doesn't activate. I'm, I'm just going to clench my butt cheeks and combo interrupt anyway. But yeah, this was weird. But yeah, thanks so much for watching. Like it if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.